Hello everyone, welcome back to another video where today I want to talk to you a little bit about my experience in the Space Babies at the Chapter Arts Theatre by uh, BAFTA Cymru. I went and obviously I can't tell you much about what I saw because it's embargoed until the 11th, but what I can tell you is I had a great time and uh, I met some wonderful people and there was a great Q&A afterwards, which again is also embargoed, so I can't tell you what they said at the Q&A, but I can tell you the Q&A was good fun. Uh, if I had to describe the episode in one particular word, it would be fun, would be the word. And I know that sort of sounds like a pretty generic kind of point of praise, but genuinely, in terms of opening episodes, probably one that I've laughed at the most in terms of opening episodes. I think uh, Shooty and Millie's chemistry really makes it, like, they are amazing together. And uh, I won't tell you anything else until the episode airs on the 11th. But I do want to tell you, I have met some really cool people. Obviously, a couple of you guys came along, which was always fun to see, but really cool. I met Stefan Powell, who hosts Doctor Who Unleashed, and uh, Phil Collinson, who is um, like the executive producer alongside like Russell T. Davis, and also a couple of the other producers, and um, Pam Down, the costume designer, and someone else whose name escapes me, Biggie D. Lau, who's another one of the producers, met them as well, but didn't get pictures with them. But just trust me when I say they were there and they were lovely. Um, yeah, it was a really fun experience. Uh, I really enjoyed myself. You know, I'm not as overwhelmed by it as uh, the Star Beast one where I met Russell, where I was like, it's Russell. But no, um, it was still a very, very fun time. And um, everyone was really nice. Yeah, the Space Babies, you know, the only thing I can say about it is it's incredibly fun. And the chemistry is immediate between those two. And you're going to enjoy it, I think, you know. I wouldn't go in expecting, you know, like a groundbreaking episode, but it's a very fun episode. I also want to give a quick shout out to um, Dragzilla on Twitter or Luke. He um, actually sent me tickets because he couldn't make it. And then, funnily enough, they listed a bunch of new tickets. So I managed to get the disabled spots. But thank you anyway to Luke for offering his tickets. It was a lovely gesture. And um, I might not have made it without it. Obviously, I did but I might not have, so thank you for that. Uh, yeah, it was a very, like, last-minute thing, you know, them adding tickets sort of at the end, um, but I was very glad they did, because it, it meant that I did have the disabled spot, and they even had, like, a little little placard with my name on it, a little bit of paper saying reserved for, and then my name, which was fun. <laughs> I felt like a proper, like, celebrity. It was weird. It was weird. Uh, yeah, it was an incredibly fun time. Stefan was lovely. I, I didn't speak to him too much. It was quite brief. But uh, I did, like, make a joke on Twitter about, you know, like, I was talking about Unleashed and stuff, and I'm coming for you, Stefan. That job's going to be mine one day. Um, but, yeah, it was it was a really good time, and I think um, you're all really going to enjoy it. It was great also speaking to Phil Collins, and he did particularly say to me whilst we were chatting in, like, sort of after drinks thing, oh, yeah, that was another thing that's, like, after drinks. I didn't have anything alcoholic because, quite frankly... I knew I was going to record this, and I didn't want to come across as super, you know, steamed. But I will say, he said, look out for episode four. Uh, he said that one's really good, without giving anything away. Um, get excited for that, I suppose. Also, some of the crew came up and said hello, and they watched my stuff, which was really, really nice. Again, you know, that's, that's always so surreal to me when that happens. It was also really nice to chat with some people that I knew from, like, the fandom. Uh, you know, lots of Twitter people, particularly uh, Kit, who's a friend of mine. Jack Alexander, obviously, I saw sort of Joe, confused Adipose, I helped him sort out some tickets. Yeah, it was a really fun time. But uh, with all that said, thank you for watching. This is a very brief video. I just want to go over my experience at this screening. If you did enjoy this video, be sure to like, comment down below your thoughts, subscribe. I didn't even tell you to subscribe. That was because, you know, I value your time. But do subscribe <laughs> if you're new. Um, People do uh, get unsubscribed by YouTube. It's a problem I've been having the last few sort of weeks. So uh, if you are new and you want to hear regular Doctor Who opinions, feel free to subscribe and also news. Thank you very much for watching, and I will see you very soon. Skibbity toilets. <laughs> <laughs> should I keep that in or should I just? <laughs>